Friday, Friday workshop. workshop. What are we doing this week in the workshop? This week we're talking about the uses of rubber bands. Yeah, we had a viewer that noticed we use rubber bands in the shop and uh, was wondering what are all the uses that we use rubber bands for? So here we go. The first use is holding string and twine and fishing line and all those sorts of things together and stopping them from going all over the place. So we put a, a rubber band on our twine and we also put rubber band on things like fishing line. So it just prevents it from unspooling. And so you can just pull more out and then uh, the rubber band stops it from over pulling. Uh, that's a great use for a rubber band. Next up is rubber bands when you glue. Holds it better together and on to the next one. I'm being super low for this shot. <laughs> so one of the cool things that you can do with rubber bands is put a bunch of nails in rubber bands. And when you go do a project, you know how you have a lot of nails and they all go all over the place? If you put a rubber band in there, you can just take nails out, you can put them back in, um, holds them together with friction, and you don't have nails going all over the place. Super useful. <laughs> Another use for the rubber band is drawing straight lines. So uh, you can measure with the measuring tape. And if you don't have a good straight edge, you just measure on both sides, put the rubber band at the mark and um, make your line. And it can go to whatever size of wood you need. Another good use of the rubber band is to shoot it at your dad while he's doing soldering. <laughs> doing <laughs> if you like videos like these check out some videos like these we got cool videos all the time oh you got me good there <laughs> sorry in the neck there dad <laughs> no, that's okay <laughs> i was aiming for your shoulder just smacked around